Talk about the process of freezing your eggs, because I think a lot of women are like, oh my God, I can't do this. It's 12 days. People don't understand how easy it is. 99% of my patients afterwards have said to me, it was so much easier than I ever thought it was going to be. Very simple. You do not need a referral. You do not need to beg your doctor to send you to a fertility specialist. You can find a good one. There's a great ones. We're happy to help wherever we can. Have people coming to us from all over the country now, thank God. You do a consultation. Consultations are easy now. 95% of my patients are still doing because of the pandemic and what we've learned from their office, from their desk, from their home, a consultation and don't have to drive to the other side of town to come and see us. And then we'll go through A through Z with you. Then we want a simple blood test and maybe an ultrasound to see how fertile you are. There's a blood test called AMH, anti-malarian hormone. This hormone is secreted from the eggs in your body. So when we check your blood on any day of the month, doesn't matter if you're on birth control or not. Um, at that time, we're gonna see if you've got a lot of AMH, you've got a lot of eggs. If your AMH is low, you've got low eggs. The day you are born, those are the eggs that you're gonna have for the rest of your body. In utero, when you're inside of the uterus, you have about 20 million. So by the time you're born, it goes down to 2 million. By the time you get your first period, those eggs have gone down to about 430,000. They die off very quickly. Every month when you release that one egg of ovulation, you are actually losing about 1,000 eggs that die off in the process of that one egg ovulating.